So what's been the key to the 5-1 and one start in Summit League conference play? Um, our offense has been doing a great job. I think our team batting average right now is around 300. So anytime you have that and you're putting up good numbers like that, and our pitching has been keeping us in the game. For you, you've been, always been a, a solid average hitter, uh, contact hitter, a guy that could hit the baseball, drive line drives. But uh, ball's flying out of the park for you this year. What's uh, flip the switch that you've become more of a home run hitter and more of a power threat for this IPFW team? Um, I've really been focusing on hitting up the middle this year. I mean, last year and the years before, I've been pull happy. So I've been staying up the middle, and the balls have just been traveling for me. For you, what was the offseason like to get ready for your senior season? Because, like I said, you played a lot of innings. Uh, your first three seasons, but you knew you were going to be counted on as, as one of the main guys specifically this season. So uh, did that change your approach to this season or change the approach that you have at the plate for uh, this coming senior season? This oh, season? yeah. I mean, I figured I was going to get a lot off speed and seeing, I mean, been in the conference for three years now. So, I mean, I figured they'd be throwing some more junk at me. That's what Coach said. He said a lot of the home runs this year have been uh, on off speed, breaking balls or change ups. So is that take a different mentality yeah. when you get up at the plate? Yeah, I mean, Basically just sitting fastball to right field and then I'll speed him trying to hit up the middle or to the left side. You've always kind of been, a, since we saw you play basketball at Elmhurst, you were a little thinner at that time. Yeah. You've added a lot of muscle. How much How much muscle have you added since you've been here at IPFW and, and maybe specifically from your junior to senior season? Um, I don't know. Like I've gained probably 25 pounds. I came in at 210, 235 right now. So, so that's, a lot of, that's a lot of work in the weight room. Yeah. Um, yeah. For this game, knowing that uh, you know IPFW being able to do what you've done, the nine home runs already this season in your hometown, does that give you a, like a, another feather in the cap? I guess to kind of special to be able to do it in your hometown and not have to you know have gone somewhere else. You get to do it in your backyard. Yeah, I mean, I like the fact that I'm still in town and that everybody's you know been giving great response to the whole team and what we've been doing throughout the season. As a senior, as a team leader, a guy who hits in the middle of the order for this club playing shortstop, uh, what do you try to impart to these younger guys? A guy like Greg, uh, who's you know getting some some innings uh, on the Division One collegiate level. What do you try to impart, given the fact that you've played so many innings for this IPFW team? Um, I just try to be the leader and try to guide them through some stuff. Uh, you know, there's mistakes here and there, and try to see what they did wrong and try to tell them what they did wrong. You know, so they can correct it for next time. Pretty much a. Uh, Offensively, a dream season for you this year? Uh, so far, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully it continues. <laughs> All right. Appreciate it, man. Thank you.